Oh, hello. <laughs> Good day and welcome to today's little vlog. Now today's vlog, oh man, is literally me getting back to work, getting back on it, switching the camera on and telling you all about what I'm going to be doing today. I've got a few vlogs in mind, but it's one of my best mate's birthday today and he's managed to squeeze me in at two o'clock where he's going to be having his little celebration at Zach's along the riverside. So I thought I'd iron a shirt. There I am. So I've got a shirt. I haven't worn one of them shirts for some time. <laughs> you like the new hair? Do you? Do you know how I got the new hair? Well, if you don't, you'll have to watch yesterday's vlog on the Dead Horse channel. Now, it's, it's early morning. I haven't even washed or scrubbed up or scrunched up. Not yet. I thought I'm going to iron this shirt first. Get the iron. So I'm just waking up. It's only about eight o'clock. I've got lots of things on my mind today. Lots of things I want to do or vlog about. But first things first. Oh, man. The winter last night was a massive storm here. Like, well, it wasn't a storm. It was just wind, wind, wind. It was like, I thought it was going to blow the house down. And then wind chimes. I'll tell you what. Oh, man. I had to get the earplugs in. But we can see we've got a bit of a bright day right here. As I take you to the creek. You can see the creek developing. <laughs> it will be a creek one day. One day, guys, I'm going to show you this creek. It's going to be a little bit more out. Uh, you can imagine the creek. But what a nice day. And that wind is, wind is, is starting to drop. So, oh, man. I'm going to make a vlog today about what I'm going to get up to. Because I'm about a week away from actually starting my channel, my vlogging channel, three months in Europe, tour of Europe is about a week away. There's a few things that I still need to get. There's a lot of things I still need to get. Man, that wind is still kicking up. It's strong. So I'm going to get the shirt iron and then when I get out and about, I've got a few little stops of places that I need to go. Uh, like I so say, I've really got to get me acting to get, start sorting things out and get rid of this congestion, man. Alrighty, one has afroed and gelled, sorry, moosed, his jerry curl here. Now, guys, look at that pan. That pan is now smoking away. So that gives me perfect opportunity to show you guys how to make the perfect omelette. Right, first, that is sprout and broccoli already pre-cooked and this is smoked bacon already pre-cooked i like to batch cook i do <laughs> and then i've got my prep and so here we are we have a bit of smoky bacon and some broccoli now hopefully that's getting a nice picture oh that's good bit of smell that's sprouting broccoli so all i really want to do is just move that about so it's mixed up okay and then it's just heating that is already hot and it's like i say it's pre-cooked so all i need to do in there now right i'm going to show you how to make the perfect omelette the perfect omelette is three eggs large eggs so here we go three one two three large eggs into the pan man now just break them in the pan there's no need to mix your eggs up in a basin creating more washing up for yourself we don't need to do that. Oh, well, we've got a bit of, we've got all that steam on there. We're steamed up. <laughs> well, we're steamed up. <laughs> oh, mate, hang on. Give us a second. We're steamed up. Is that better? Yes. Now, look, you see, so you've got your three eggs. They're already in there. And now what you do, this is how you make an omelette properly, guys. Now, especially if uh, you don't want to spend all day. Right, now, hang on. I'm just going to take that off the heat and then move that down. So that is now on the grill. So the grill is getting hot. There's enough heat in this pan to cook this omelette, as you can see. So just move it about. Obviously, if you've got two hands free and uh, you're not doing any film work, you'll be able to do this a lot easier than what I am. But as you can see, that's it. And just break that down. That's your omelette, man. There, right, right there. 
just leave that on that pan. That is resting. Put that bit of bacon back in there. And then move on to the cheese. Now the only cheese I've actually got right now is some feta. <laughs> Before, now I'm just breaking it up. So, uh-huh, why is it camera? So I just sprinkle it on the top. There you go. Oh man, that's a great big lump there. You don't want too many big lumps. Just eat that all about. And there you go. That is on there. Bit of feta, bacon, sprat and broccoli, and feta and egg. Oh, goes together really well. Now I've got tomatoes, but tomatoes will not do the job. They will not. So that's just cooking away. Just cooking through with that. Lightly fluffing up all that egg. And that until that great grill, just waiting for the grill to get hot, which it is, and then we just put our omelette under the grill right there. Leave that for five minutes where it will be get treated with some of that and then eat it with some of that. So I'll get out a couple of minutes. Ah, uh -huh, put the kettle on. We'll have a cappuccino and I'll get that into me. Now, most of you will probably be into the five a day. Load of rubbish, that's why you're all getting diseases. Five a day. You need at least 11, or like me, maybe 17 a day. But I will tell you the secret of this little omelet. Those three large eggs contain enough vitamins and minerals for your recommended daily amount alone. Just three eggs in a large omelet, and you have your RDA of vitamins, vital vitamins and minerals. So there you go, I have a free egg omelette most days, maybe every other day. And I'll throw a bit of broccoli, a bit of other stuff in there, just for good measure. And then smother it, even though that tastes really good, it do need the HP. Alrighty, remember when you take out your pan from the grill, remember to put a cloth on the handle. Yeah, yeah, good tip. Now. Because that has been heated, watch this, right? Because that has been heated from above, it has released it from beneath and become non-stick. So I can just transfer that all in one lump with one hand, just like that. Awesome, right? That's how I cook a proper omelette, guys. You will need oh, the other hand because look at this. We're having that. Go on, pour it all on there, mate. Go and pour it on there. That is superb. That's your key ingredient. Fork. Fork. Ah, oh, fork. Oh, taste. It's really good. Mmm. Broccoli and bacon. It's an excellent combination. Extra mature cheddar, just as good. Put what you like on there. I've got feta, and that is proper. Mm. Start to the day. And a cappuccino. Oh, to set me on my way today. Right. Oh, let's go out vlogging. Alrighty. Alrighty, <laughs> just had a quick stop. I am, I am. It is, guys. I don't know whether you know. It's Easter bank holiday weekend, and I am now. I'm at Chapperfield Park. I've got a few things I'd like to do today. And I did drive past yesterday, and I saw the fun fair right here in Chapperfield Gardens setting up. So I just drove around, it's all parking around, they're all parking meters, look, it's all zoned, so don't park your car there, you'll get nicked and that. But I, I did see a couple of cars in the vicinity, so I thought I'd blend in. I am, I'm doing a bit of blending. Got me mic there, we're all there. There's just a vehicle coming down, I'll keep an eye on, <laughs> right there. But we are at the fun of the fair. Chaos wagon, that is a wicked looking truck. It really is. Oh man. So the fair starts. Not sure if it started tonight. I'm not sure if it starts or gets piped up later on today. Just having a look about <laughs> to see what the fair's like. There's someone. Wonder if this guy'll talk to me. You alright there, buddy? 
Do you mind being on camera? You don't mind? Ah, oh, all right. Good eye. You, you, what, what is this one called? It's not the waltzes, is it? It's Matterhorn. Matterhorn. Yeah. I know you open today. I hope so, yeah. Saturday, Sunday, and Monday? Yep. There you go. Okay, guys, so it's open Friday. What time do you, do you start? Be about two o'clock today. Okay. And you go up to about midnight, 10 o'clock? No, about nine, 10 o'clock. About nine or 10 o'clock. Yeah. And that's today, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and Monday? Yeah. Top man. Mate, have a good day. Appreciate your time, buddy. Yeah, Thank you. There you go, guys. You now have the full itinerary of the fun fair. And it does look good. I mean, this look, I might have to come because this looked pretty scary. Doesn't it, right? I've obviously come, come a long way. King Loops. Oh, I think I'll be doing a, that they all spin round on each other and I'll go up and down. <laughs> I had a bad enough experience when I was in Malaysia in Kuala Lumpur when I went on the indoor um, theme park and I was a little bit scared there. I was. So you have a crazy chaos fun house. Got interesting stuff, but <laughs> harder to go to. Oh, look at it. See, it's good that there's no one here. Because you can get a good look at these rides. Man, ah, that look, you see them, they're all strapped up. You are gonna scream and probably go faster. Now, this looks like a little bit of a trapeze thing going on. <coughs> Excuse me, I am a bit chesty. Now, this is not part of the fun fair, this whole bit of wood that's actually there all the time. But I've forgotten what it represents. It used to be a clock. Oh, that's long gone. They used to be the world's most um, uh, clock, which kept the best time. But guess what? They could never, ever get it to work properly. So that's long gone. They used to be in a big glass case right about here. So there's a few people about there checking the place out. High energy. There's going to be... <laughs> there's going to be a really good place to come and have a party. There really is. You all right there? Good day. You all right, darling? You all right? You work here? Oh yeah? You do? What do you do, darling? What do you do? Are these trapeze? No. No? Is this all family owned or? You're part of a family? Is it the Gray's family? Oh, so who? Being filmed you don't? Okay, no, no worries. You all right? You all right? I was just wishing you all the best. Yep. You're all right, have a good day. <laughs> oh man, and in Chapelfield, you do still have your old tea hut. Oh man, the chess board is still here. It is, sort of. I don't know if you can still rent your chess pieces from out there. I really don't know. <laughs> Funny. So here we go, that is the fun fair that will take place later. You've got a help a skelter. <laughs> fun and games and all sorts going on. <sighs> right, I'm going to get back to my car because, guys, I'll tell you what, <laughs> I'm cold. You cold? Yeah. It is cold, isn't it? Oh, and we do have, are they Wurlitzers? Waltzers. Waltzers, that's what they are. That is where the bloke will get on the back, spin you round if you want to go faster. That's the, one. That's the one. Cheers, guys. Have a good day. Cheers. All the best. Wicked. Right. I'd better get on with me day. And it is. It's proper cold. It is. Whoa. Whoa. One minute. It's really cold. The next minute. Excuse me. It's really sunny. So you know where I am? I am on Riverside Road, right opposite Cow Tower, and I'm I'm going in there, Zach's Burger Bar. Oh man! Now I've just been to see me ma and John, and I actually saw me brother. Oh, hang on, I'm going to intercept someone, and he says I look like Nick Hartnell. <laughs> it's the name going, Mr. Steele. How you doing? How you doing? I'm good, I'm good. Good to see you, eh? Right? Good, I'm coming in. Do you mind being on film? No, I don't mind. Because the day I'm at Zach's, because it's, it's this guy's brother's birthday. 
I'm in a sunset bar. Okay, I won't. Can I? Okay. Um, can I just film me here, there, darling? Wicked. All right. Can't film. Ready? Sneaky bit of film. This is Matthew, and this is Matthew taking, taking the first bite of his birthday burger. Here's your nose. Where is it? Everywhere. Yeah. All over his jeans. You need a bib, mate. You need a bib. It's not bad. Vinegar has arrived. For the curly chips. A bit of illegal filming going on. <laughs> Hang on. That weren't a bad effort, Matthew. I'm making a mess. It's all right. How? Oh, hang on. I have a burger. Bacon burger. <laughs> oh, man. Lime. Going in. That is a tasty burger. Well, is this the one that was held for us? You changed the bar. No, no, this is Mark Two. Mark Two. I ain't got the sound. Yeah. yeah. Well, I, yeah well, oh, actually. Yeah, no, that'd be working on the sound. There. Oh, that's good. All right, hang on. I'll sit that off. This is Sue. Hello. Uh, hello, Sue. <laughs> this is Mafu. Mafu. Oh, right. and Sue. <laughs> it's Mafu's birthday. Hey. Hey. Looking patiently. Oh, you've gone then, Tyler. Where are you going? This is nice. There you go. This is Sally. And Elaine. Hi. Hi. <laughs> and Sai. Hello. So, <laughs> guys, that was just a short vlog of just oh, what I'm having about doing today. You may see me on the other channel to know her with this young lady. But until then, thanks for watching. And until next time, oh, sorry, cheers for watching. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And until next time, That's it. Oh, okay.